The first sign. Wait, that video. More than 200 struck with mysterious disease in India by rooters. Let me go back a bit. Uh, was it right here? It is stable. Blood samples were sent to labs and no viral infections were detected. Uh -huh. All the patients were tested for COVID-19 and all tested negative according to local media reports. The state government is now focusing on the areas where the case... <clears throat> That's the first, well, technically not the first stage, but it's the next stage of what this Pac-Man virus does. It's gotten into their, oh, Central and peripheral nervous system. Of course you're not going to find it in the blood. It's not there anymore. It's moved. Into their brains. Take a look at that video. You'll see one dude flipping the fuck out and screaming. The zombie apocalypse is starting. You humans... You don't have much time left. Like I said before, don't get upset, depressed, or angry, or sad over it. It's too late for that. You don't have any time. You don't have any stretches of continuance left to bitch about things. It's time to get your heads right. And I don't mean with religion. I don't mean with your snarky, better-than-thou attitudes. I don't mean with your self-righteousness. I mean, it's time to get real fucking humble. Real fucking fast. Well, there's more to it than just that. <clears throat> it's time to get really fucking concerned about the state of your own existence at all levels real fucking fast because pretty soon you're not even going to have that option left but this video that I've Seen is the first that corroborates what I've already known is going to happen. You idiots will have to do a goddamn spinal fluid tap to find where it is. Seriously. Now, the, this is also one of the reasons why I said Dr. Chris Martinson from Peak Prosperity is too slow. You're going on and on about what the CDC did, how they got it wrong for them start. <laughs> <laughs> going on about things that are done and gone. At this point, What even Dr. Chris needs to do is throw away making videos about the, the situation that's going on. Because it's not going to help. It's not going to make a damn bit of difference. It never did. Yeah, for most of humanity, it starts with humility and humiliation. Too many of you are arrogant, conceited, self-righteous, self-sured about things you know nothing about. And granted, I don't have all the information, but I do have a good bit more than all of you combined.
you know, there's certain things that just aren't necessary to know. And then there's other things I just don't want to know. Point in case, I don't give a fuck about anyone's sex life. <coughs> That's irrelevant to me. Unless I want to fuck some girl, I don't give a fuck about their sex life. Just no fucking way. Keep it to yourself. I don't want or need to know. It's a manner of propriety. Honor, discipline, respect, self-control. Which is... It'll stem from humility. And it's a bunch of stuff that you humanity don't have that's why we're here in the second lowest level of hell well not me but all of you yes I'm here to fix some fucking problems that all of you started and Satan was here to do that too don't know where the fuck he is right now none of my business right now I don't need to know. Whenever I talk to him again is when I'll talk to him again. Me and I both agreed. It's time for this bullshit to end. But here I am, still saying, you fucking humans need to change. Because it's part of my job to give a fuck. Ta for those opportunities all the way up until the point where it'll have absolutely no effect and then I'll stop. Oi, I have stopped bitching about things. <coughs> I'm not cussing and ranting and screaming like I used to. I'm simply telling you all, you've got very little time left. You need to get real humble and humiliated about all the bullshit you've done, and how corrupt you are, and how much of a little bitch you are. Every last one of you. Every last single one of you. Otherwise, you wouldn't be here in hell. It's a bubble of reality, a dimension, as it were. Last I checked, and I'm still holding to that belief, you're all, and unfortunately, I'm stuck here with you in the second lowest level of hell. I could call names and point out things, but that wouldn't have any real effect. It wouldn't have any effect on helping the situation. Helping all of you change and become less of a bitch. Less self-righteous. Less self-assured of things you know nothing about. Less of a piece of garbage. Less of a toxic fucking piece of shit. I could point fingers, name names, and show examples. All fucking day. But it's not gonna help. <sighs> Americans, you lack honor. You lack discipline. You lack respect you lack self-control massively you're in a massive need of humiliation for this first symptom of the next stages of the pac-man virus progression to actually be here in america instead of in india 
But Satan is the one who's playing the game of Plague Inc. Evolved with this planet, not me. He's the one who made that decision, not me. And no, I'm not going to try to change his mind. If, and at this point it is an if to me, if I manage to get to talk to him again, I'm just going to ask him, why India? Is it because you're playing a game of Plague Inc. Evolved? Because <laughs> to him, it's just a joke and a game. Your lives, that is. Your entire species, humanity. You've become nothing but a game and a joke to him. His job doesn't include giving a fuck about you. Mine, on the other hand, does. I suggest you take advantage of the very limited opportunities I'm still throwing at you. Google, Alphabet, YouTube, I suggest you heavily uncensor this video. I suggest you all listen intently. I suggest you make changes to the condition in which your souls and minds exist in. Because as you are all so fond of saying, time is running out.